Make sure reading the lore makes the stream more immersive. Yeah. And I do, yeah, I, that's the thing. That's why I do lore. Well, there's many reasons I do it. <gasps> no! Yeah, I'm cool. That was me. I must have triggered some kind of safety game or something. Henry, see if we can lift this. So, this is awkward. Sammy's not as confident as Ellie. What? Hey, this thing isn't budging, man. Just go, get out of here. Sam, you stay close to him. Henry, we gotta fucking move! You keep him safe, go! They should make some noise. They should they should make some noise. Because then the clickers will come to the gate and they won't be able to get to it, right? That would be a good idea, I think, no? Aww, dude, Sam, I just want to hug Sam. I need to kill something. What? Can we use a shotgun? Do you think they heard that chat? Where's the ammo? Okay. Nailed it. Oh, I think Henry trying to be tough with Sam actually overprotected him. A little bit, a little bit, but it's, you, when you remember that like, they've probably been at this for a while and Henry probably had to grow up fast. He can't, he had to like push himself to do that. Do you know what I mean? Um, He doesn't want to be as tough as he, as he is in general, but he kind of needs to. Why are they all running? What the f***? Because they're those runner ones. Ah, oh, shit. I forgot about those. They're like coming for me, huh? I don't like these ones. You can come to me, bitch. Fuck. I... I... I forgot the shoot button. <laughs> I don't know why I do that. Dude, these are straight freaking me out. Oh! <laughs> no! Oh! Scary! I have to sneeze, I have to sneeze, I have to sneeze, I have to sneeze. It won't emerge. Ah, oh, I saw the sneeze. This is not the right time to reload. No! No, 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 please! Please! No! It was going so good, chat. It was going so good. Dude, there's so many of them. This is scary shit. Okay, now I know why they didn't make noise, because they, they, okay. Yeah, I understand now, it makes perfect sense. Kill, murder, okay, we're good. Come on. All right, take him out. Okay, that one's out. There's not too many more, which is good because I freaking hate these things. They suck. What's this? Healing, excellent. What the f where did you come from? No, 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 I'm clicking the button. How dare you? All right, beautiful, beautiful. If this is RE4, she wouldn't be missing. That's true. I'm weirdly good. <gasps> I'm full of shivs. I need stuff, please. What do you mean? 
Reload the ammo. But you like the Yakuza games? Yeah, you know what? A lot of, uh, a few people have mentioned that, those games to me. No. <gasps> we can do more tools now. I wasn't even planning to play this game, you know what I mean? So like, it's just like, I don't know, I like suggestions like that. Like God of War, I have definitely turned my mind around on God of War. I'm probably gonna end up playing that game. I just really, it's fun to just play a story game and just vibe and not do challenges and not be scared. Also, <gasps> I, oh, they're doing school. It's like a classroom. Why couldn't they keep it safe? Son, I wish I knew. God knows they didn't deserve it. At least there are no dolls in this one. Look that ladder down. Literally, as you said that, I saw this doll, dude. Like that. Non-stop challenges. Yeah, yeah. I really like both those games, but sometimes I just don't feel like playing Bloodborne. I think about Bloodborne is it's a really unforgiving challenge right now. Go ahead. Cause like I'm at PB two, right? So if I die at all, it's like basically a reset. So it's just it's just tough. I didn't search in there. Okay, gotta double check this look. Wait, did I search here? My goofy name for God of War. Oh, Dad of Boy. I get it. That makes sense. I don't know why I didn't pick up on that. My brain isn't what it once was. I do like how he calls him boy. I like his voice. The voice. Do you guys watch? Do you guys watch Star Trek? Start not Star Trek. Sorry, Stargate. Because uh, that was the voice. I didn't realize that it was the voice. Okay, the guy who did uh, the voice work for Kratos played Teal'c from Stargate. And I was like, bro, I fucking love Teal'c. I should have known by those fucking beautiful vocal cords. He's such a good character. Is that Ellie? Come on. You know that's Ellie. <gasps> Joel, that's them. Sam! Oh, thank God. Oh. We gotta keep running. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 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 go. So we'll see Atlanta roll like Kratos. Yeah, yeah. Did he do all the voices of all the Kratoses? Like, they didn't change the voice work, right? You see that video of him? Do Dude, the, yeah, the Polygon video of him doing dad jokes. I was deceased. He's no oh, so we only did the latest game. Well, that that makes it even better then. Oh, oh, gimme, gimme. Close the door. That's not how it works, I guess. Okay. Item? No. I'm definitely gonna play. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. I don't know when. I'm playing a few too many games right now. I like to stick it to around three, and right now I'm playing kind of four because I'm still working on Hollow Knight, but I haven't played Hollow Knight in a while, so I'll make a day for that. I don't know. I'm playing too much. It's a good problem. There's some stuff happening through here, chat. Let me tell you. Make it fast. Come on, Sam. You're not staying here. What about you? I'll be fine. Come on. Go. Oh, they're getting them out, and then we're meeting up with them later. It's the best feeling having too many games to play. I know. I know. It's a good feeling. It's a good feeling. But like, I'm kind of. I was playing. I kind of want to finish Little Nightmares. Village is definitely priority. Oh shit, shit, shit. Not that button, not that button, wrong button, wrong button. Oh shit, 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 shit. Oh, uh, I meant to do that? No! No, no, shiv him, shiv him! Oh, let's go! I've never gotten to use that yet, chat. Reload, 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 reload. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. You're good, dude. Okay. 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 New weapon. Doors open. Let's go. 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 
I'm surprised his, his pectorals were not too large. Star! I have not cried yet today. I got close though. I got close. Oh, I've been feeling feelings. I no, I'm not gonna fucking cry. I refuse. I don't cry. There's nothing wrong with crying, but it's just like you know, once you start and you just get more, you know, no, 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 no. It once, it's like when you drink a lot of beer and then you have to pee. Like once the floodgates are opened, we're close. You know, so I can't. I can't. Here's the secret: is I'm very good at combat. I I say that facetiously, but I've done a lot of combat in this game because I have uh, failed almost every stealth segment. So that's the real secret. It's just be bad at stealth. I have a ton of games, just don't feel like playing them half the time. I get it, yeah. Speech tone is so consistent, I don't even notice... I don't even notice you just made it out of the sewer fight. Oh yeah, that's true. I wasn't concerned. Here's the thing, there's always like 50 enemies coming at me. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> Yeah, it's true. I'm very, very quick. Yo, Sean! Welcome in! This game is one of the few that have actually made me cry. Yeah, it hit me, dude. It hit me. I am proud of you, Ellie. Dude, I'm gonna feel feelings. But your thirst for blood compensates that? Yes. When I feel, like, crying, because something is- like, I'm- I'm telling you, dude. It's the... It's the- it's- it's Sam going for that toy. Every time I think about it, I can feel it. I can feel the instincts. It's just too much. It's pretty intense back there, huh? Why do you guys keep saying that? There was no camping. A friend of mine, Marlene, asked him to take me to the park. Yeah, well, now I just lost my mind. Aww. Isn't that right, Joel? Yes. Indelibly true. Do you have a childhood trauma of leaving a toy behind at a store? Um, I, I don't know. I think it's because, like, I was a very toy-oriented child. Do you know what I mean? Like, I really, really liked my toys. And it's just something about him and, like, it, just having to live in this world... And then also having just wanting to pick up a toy, you know? Oh, dude, it hits me. I it, it's I think it's because it I can totally put my like I'm very empathetic normally. Like I just have a lot of empathy for, for various situations. But that one, and most of the time I feel something, but when I when I get the instinct, that it just hit different, you know what I mean? There's another one. Oh yeah, yeah. I haven't changed at all. All the plushies behind me, that's true. But there's this um you know, there's just certain things that just get you, you know what I mean? When you just think about it. I don't want to talk about the other one because it's just like something that's like sad and it'll make me feel things. But you know, there's just like things that we get that hit us. All of us have them. Our emotional buttons, I guess. Do you know what I mean? Um, I didn't cry. I haven't cried a single time so far. <laughs> another night, another shooting. I could see the muzzle flashes coming from the Carson's windows. I stayed up the entire night with the whole family in one room. I doubt anybody got any sleep. It's only a matter of time before the looters try to break into our house. We have to get out of here. That skinny man approached us again. He traded more of his bullets for some of our food. He offered us to join him in his hideout. He says it's secure and most, more importantly, hidden. Easily defendable is how he described it. He said that the only reason he trusts me is because I have kids. I don't think we can stay here any anymore. He seems like a trustworthy guy. I'm going to suggest to everyone tomorrow that we take him up on his offer, Kyle. We know what happened. This is, this is where Kyle lived. Well, Joel, come on now. See, that's another interesting coping mechanism. So, Joel, by saying that, it, okay. Whatever Kyle and his family did, they were probably in a bad spot. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> so, what he did was make the decision to do that. But, I don't know how to explain this, because I, I don't really know the psychological term. But, um, it's, it's like when you blame other people for things that happen to them as a coping mechanism. So for example, Joel thinks I have survived because of choices I've made. And it's a survival coping mechanism because all the bad choices he's made has led to not quite projection. Proje projection is comparable. Um, actually, it might be a form of proje projection. But basically what he does is he, all decisions he's ever made has led to him being alive, even the really bad things he's done, right? So because of that, he needs to tell himself that everything he's done has been worth it. So when he sees someone who makes a bad choice, the reason he makes that snarky comment is because, 
you know, it makes it Kyle's horrible fate was his fault and he doesn't have to feel bad about it. Do you know what I mean? I'm not explaining this properly, but there's a term for it. Um, there's a term for everything as it turns out. Um, but just in general, that way, instead of going like, you know, oh, shit, and, and thinking about what happened to him, he just thinks, oh, he made the wrong choice, therefore he died. I made the right choices. Whoa, okay, that was a weird little flash arena. Um, I made the right choices, therefore I'm alive. So, anyway. You remember any of that, Joel? Joel does, that's for sure. I have a gun, you loot, I shoot. I barely remember yesterday. So, he is at least, like, hang on. He remembers this, this was right after the outbreak. So, the outbreak was 20 years ago. This guy is at least... He looks younger than, like, mid-20s. Anyway. Um, I was about to say, maybe he's 25. Smells. Smells are the most, uh, like, the human brain remembers smells the most. I mean, he's 30s, he's still young. Yeah, he's young as hell, but I just, I, like, when I looked at him, I thought maybe he's, like, around 18-ish. Like I said, I'm, I'm apparently terrible at ages. But then again, it's a video game phase, so I feel better about it. I'm terrible at ages, though. I When I say young, I just thought he was under 20 for a while, that's all. I still think like 60s young, dude. Oh, I've checked this house. Olfactory senses are linked with memories. Yes, so smell usually brings nostalgia. Yeah, I think it's just like the most, it's like the most nostalgic thing or like a uh, link to memory, something like that. Joel's probably mid fifties. I would estimate around there because then he'd be around 30 in his thirties when he had uh, a 14 year old daughter. And that sounds about right. I don't want to stay away from those. It's not like it is in the zone. These are wild. Nothing scarier than wild dogs, chat. Here we go. Do let's just do clip capacity because I actually feel like that's a good idea. Because then we can hold more ammo. Because I always seem to be out of it. Also, spread should be good, I think. And then like clip capacity. And then armor piercing. That seems strong. Oh, that's expensive though. Ooh. Never mind. <laughs> I'd rather upgrade more guns because I haven't really decided on a favorite, I guess. So. Maybe. I don't think we checked this house. Ooh, it's a good thing we did. So much stuff here. Father's note Kara, you're the adult while I'm gone. Take care of your brother. He's looking to you for protection now. I won't be gone for more than a few days to gather food and supplies. If for some reason I haven't returned after a week, take your brother and head to the Pittsburgh quarantine zone. Don't open the door to anyone but me. Save your bullets. If you have to leave, stay low and move quickly. Use your size to your advantage. I'll see you soon, Dad. Yeah, ceiling's falling apart. It's fucking sad. I'm glad we noticed that. You find anything? Thank Lore? You. Oh, damn! Melee weapon, like, upgrades? Cool. Yeah, I, I'm glad I spotted that. That seems like a hard thing to find. Here's the thing, there's probably other things that were comparable. That I probably missed, but oh well. We do what we can. I'm glad I found that. That's cool. I always like finding the things that seem hard to find, I guess. Oh, shit, dogs. I really hope they don't make us fight dogs, dude. That'd be so sad. Second playthrough confirmed? Yeah. That's the truth. I, I'm I'm actually... This is my second playthrough. <laughs> I'm, like, simultaneously good at finding things and bad at finding things. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like I, I notice things, but then I, I completely miss obvious things. 
perfectly balanced that all as all things should be. You can probably get some more upgrades at that tool bench, but I don't know. I like this. They really give you the opportunity to loot, but they also just kind of go like you don't need to look for everything. Oh, it's the bash. That's cute. Aww. One open door. That's all it took. One of us forgot to close the door and a horde of those monsters entered our camp. We shut them in there and wrote a warning on the outside. Susan and a couple of the kids- Oh, Susan! Susan was downstairs. And a couple of the kids are with me. As far as I know, we're the only survivors. I had to hold Susan so she wouldn't run back in there, go back for the bodies. It's just too dangerous. She lost her children and I have no clue what to say to her. Every part of my being just wants to give up. It'd be so easy to surrender to this world. I can't do that though. I have too much faith in humanity. I've seen that we're still capable of good. We can make it. I have to stay strong for her. That's heartbreaking. We really get the history of the people. Like we, we find that um, settlement in the sewers and then we get to find the people who, what they said. Uh, and then, you know, you see their hope and their joy and then, oh no, I don't have the combination. Oh dang it. Well, I gotta look for that then. That's sad. Ah, 82136. Nice. Um, a lot of post apocalyptic games do that, but most of them don't focus as much on the story. Like, for example, we can get this kind of lore in, like, a, like, a Fallout type game, but it tends to be focused on one specific location, if that makes sense. So, like, you go to a vault, and the vault will tell you, um, all about the people there and what happened to them, and some of them are funny, some of them are goofy, some of them are dark. Um, but this yeah. keeps it going, and it extends it. And they're showing you what happened to the people, and it's horrible. And then we get to find out how they lived and what they were thinking, and their their thoughts and, and hopes and everything. So many pills, let's go. Maybe we can upgrade something. Okay, we have 40. So we can upgrade our healing speed, crafting speed, listen mode distance. I think he, maybe crafting speed? I don't know. Why not, really? We should have maybe waited, but eh. It's a hard pill to swallow. Uh. No, no. You, you I'm not allowed to play darts. Oh my god, they're so cute. Okay, just gonna check this backyard. Aww. Didn't you guys ever have one of these, like, mini houses? Like, any of these mini swing sets and stuff? I did not, but I always wanted one of the mini houses. Fireflies are here. Yeah, by the looks of it. How are we gonna find them? I know a guy. My brother, actually. He was a fire. Right, that's where we're going. Last I heard, he was in Wyoming. Oh we god, Wyoming? Find him, we find the fireflies. Can you say you? <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, man. So wait, this is just a dead end? Dang, what is the purpose of all this? Like, I guess just like loot, but like now- Okay, here's the problem. I thought we'd just go down the street. And now that I see that we don't just go down the street, I don't know where the heck we go. What is this? Oh. And this is an ice cream truck. An ice cream truck? Yeah, Henry told me about these. Tell ice cream out of the truck. Dang. Is it really a dead end if you're still a live streamer? Good point. That's true. This thing drive around and play real loud, creepy music, and kids would come running out to buy ice cream. You're totally fucking with me. Mm mm, serious. <laughs> Man, he lives in a strange time. <laughs> Told you so. Wow. I had a tree fall on my swing set? Oh my god. Uh, okay. <gasps> what is that? Just bear with me. You want to hear a joke about pizza? Never mind. It was too, too cheesy. Yeah, me neither. What? Oh, because you don't want pizzas. Say to the purple grape. Breathe, you idiot. <laughs> that's so stupid. <laughs> oh, because he couldn't breathe. Yay. Uh... Oh, that's it. I wanted more. Ah. Uh... All right, 
I got a joke for you. Let's Philosophy stuff. Oh! Can your nose be 12 inches long? I don't know why. Because then it will be a foot. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how many inches are in a foot. I don't know these American things. Alright, that's funny. I like that a lot. Okay. Um Let's see. Maybe maybe reload speed? And then we can do Hmm. Okay, I like that. That's good. Dad jokes are my fave. Right! Oh wait, Henry's just standing over there. It seems promising. Is there something going on over here, my friend? <laughs> I'm confused as to where we go, so I don't really know. <laughs> like, is is he is he showing me that I'm going the wrong way? Like, probably, because they wouldn't make us backtrack after all this. But then, where are we going? We should check out the house that he's in front of, because maybe there's something there, I don't know. Like, what is our purpose? Our purpose is, like, big picture. Did I not come in here? I thought I came in this one. Oh my god. Oh, of course, wait. Oh, of course, of course, of course, of course. Yeah, see, I wasn't looking for the exit because I thought it would be very self-evident. Um, but now I get it. We just need to go through the house. Okay, I was hoping we could open that. <gasps> More homes. Uh-oh, cutscene. Uh-oh. The sniper. Did you see where came from? Somewhere down the street. Right now. I'll stay here. No. Before you start. I need you guys to keep him busy. I'm gonna go around and see if I can't get That's you. fair. That's good. Okay. The AI on the enemies in this game is actually really good. They they surround you and they are they're sneaky. Like it actually surprises me. Um, because like I've been snuck up on them so many times because I think I know where they are and I don't. Oh, there he is, right there. Sniper's nest, baby. This ain't your curse, man. Oh! Son of a bitch! I didn't think he had line of sight. Oh my god! There's freaking enemies here! Oh my god, I fucked it up. I didn't think that there'd be more enemies. I thought there was just the one enemy. It turns out I was very wrong. See if that helps. Okay. And I'm guessing these houses will be largely- yeah, these houses are looted already. I like that! That was like a really- that was a good section. It was very, um... Uh, false sense of security. I, I really was like, oh. Whoa! Oh, come on! <laughs> Back to my roots. Dude, there's so many! That'll hurt. Oh my god, no! <gasps> oh my god, the difficulty. The difficulty fucking jump, dude. They were just like... Not the difficulty, but you know what I mean. Like the... You know? Okay. Oh, 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 shit, they're coming. Oh, shit. I'm trying to hide behind cover! Okay, I'm out of, uh, ammo there? Hmm. <laughs> I don't know what I expected. 
I mean, I can't really do stealth when, like, they see me, you know? If they got a sniper calling sh** out, like, that's not ideal. I hope you know where I am. Oh, I missed. Son of a bitch. Okay. Dude, you're not dead? You should be very dead, my friend. Oh my god. I'm really running low on ammo. You have been shot, like, twice. Okay. Easy money. <gasps> okay. Enemies are less accurate while you're sprinting away. Yeah, okay, like, but... I'm getting sniped. <laughs> By some dingus, dude. That was fast. what you like to see. Okay, switch to this. And boom. And... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah! Dude, they're not allowed to use Meowlatovs on me. That's my shtick. How do you switch, like, so the, like, like, you know? The shoulders? How do I switch shoulders? I forgot how. Is it with a RAV special? Yeah, exactly. Okay, so that one needs to die first. Yeah, you're dead. Okay. Heal it up a little bit. R1? Is it R1? It is! Oh, thank you. I, this game has so many very nice and helpful controls. But it's also difficult to deal with when uh, you forget them, you know? Now Dog it's a much more on their AI and animation tech. To be fair though, if I th if you throw a grenade, like grenades are hard to see in the grass, I'm sure, you know? See, that's the thing, he's calling out where I am, so how the heck am I supposed to be sneaky? Like, you can't be sneaky in this segment, you have to like, get good. Okay, so they kind of know where you are, okay. <gasps> See this shit. Oh my god. I thought they were supposed to be keeping him busy. I'm gonna decease. It turns out that shit really hurts. This ain't your curse, man. I just- I just clicked a, a thing! Smoke bomb! I forgot- okay, okay, okay. That was a very big hint. I forgot about smoke bombs. That's my fault. Yeah, 100% my bad. I goofed it. I forgot about smoke bombs. That would probably help a lot, as it turns out. That was the best smoke bomb of all time. Oh, there you are. What do you mean? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Go! <laughs> Just close your eyes when I die, okay? Do me that favor. Cause, uh. <laughs> Alright, there's a bunch of dingus is coming. Run, 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 run. Quick, 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 quick. Sprint! Let's get this money! Speed run! Okay, okay, go upstairs. No, 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 not through the beats. Upstairs, 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 upstairs. No, 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 no. Where is it? Where are you at? Dingus. Huh? 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 Wait, am I in the wrong house? Nah, oh, dang it. I hate when I'm in the wrong house. Real shitty situation. They lost track of me. They're stupid. Dude, I know he's in here. 
You can't hide from me. Beat him up, beat him up. Kick him down the stairs. Yeah, baby, it's gonna smart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One more time. Uh oh, uh oh, oh, he's got friends, he's got friends, he's got friends. <gasps> no, 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 no. We've made it so far. You can't. But also, he dropped ammo, and you know how I feel about ammo. Come on, Joel Arino, get it together, brother. Can't tank a couple hits. What's going on? Okay, run. Okay, he's probably upstairs, this dingus. Wasn't this a deathless run? Uh, yeah. Sneaky, sneaky. I knew it. I knew it. Beat him up, beat him up, beat him up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's why you don't bring a knife to a Joel fight, baby. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, okay, don't shoot them, those are friends. Shoot this guy, and then shoot this man's. Oh, that was like a, like a leg shot, dude. He's deceased, that's right in the, um, what's that, what's that vein that's like in your thigh that you will decease if you get hit in it? The big one? No, that was a headshot. I played Call of Duty, I know what happens. Ephemeral, thank you, yes, ephemeral. Very in the ephemeral. All right, let's aim for the carotid this time, right in the carotid. I think that was carotid-y. All right, what other, what, what other arteries? That was right in the appendix. Saved them thousands of dollars in surgery fees. Okay, show me. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Kidney shot. Let's go, baby. <gasps> Why would they show me that? I have to be better, chat. I have to be better. I can't let it happen again. Oh sh! No 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 no. Oh! That was the butt cheeks. You know he is dead. You don't even need to ask. Carotid. Come on, I can shoot- I can shoot in there. No, I can shoot- come on. Come on, I'm hitting somebody. The gamer lean forward? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm in. I need- I need to be closer. <gasps> oh, oh. Right in the hoodie. That's his weak point, dude. This is fucking weak point. Alright, alright. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, alright. They're pinned down, they're pinned down. It's fine, everything's under control. Dude, this is weirdly fun. They actually do explain why they have a Humvee. Oh no, I missed. <gasps> no, I thought he was gonna poke his head out. Come on, you need a driver. Damn it! Damn it, I threw it! I wasn't ready! Don't tell FaZe Clan! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go! Why do they keep saying intense? There's no camping here! It's driving me bonkers! Right. Clippin said it a face clan, let's go. <laughs> Intense. There's no tense. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, 
Oh, oh, oh! No, 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 no! Oh, did I get a double kill? Yeah. Yo, that's you. Hello, welcome in. People leave. Let's <laughs> move. Dude, this feels so cathartic after like being shot a lot. Oh no, that's a clicker. We need it. We need to kill that one like ASAP. Dude, why am I so bad? Oh my god. Don't tell anyone. Shit! They can handle it, right? It's fine. Listen, I'm not the only person with a gun here. That's too many. That's too many. That's too many. How many shots is that? Five that I missed. You're okay. Still here. Anybody hurt? Uh, no, we're good. I think it's time we quit this place. Come on. Let's go. Let's actually go, dude. <laughs> Shut the hell up. They made it. Two Harleys and drive cross country. Oh, I could die happy if I could just ride one around the block. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like? It's good. It's really good. Good. Can, can you believe this guy? Come on, man. Give me details. Describe it. You know what? <laughs> you two deserve a little privacy. No, no, Ellie, Ellie. This isn't just any regular motorcycle, okay? Oh, you don't get me started on Harleys. Nothing like it. I know, I know. You know. It's a See chopper. You. I know. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. That is not the sound of a Harley. Harley's more like... You know? That was a speed bike when you go... You know? Harley suck. I'm not personally a Harley fan. Part about it all. They're noisy. Obnoxiously loud. I don't like things that are noisy. I'm not a big noisy fan. Well, it's safe to say those two have officially bonded. It's true, they have. It's cute. What are you doing? I'm taking stock of all the food we found today. Aw, sweetie. You, you know what I mean? Like, he's How so. doing on canned peaches? Did Henry send you? No. Why would Henry send me? To make sure I'm not fucking up somehow. Oh, sweetie. I'd say we all did pretty good back there. Especially you. Is everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. Okay. Well... Have a good night. How is it that you're never scared? Who says that I'm not? What are you scared of? Uh, let's see. Scorpions are pretty creepy. That's true. Uh, being by myself. Aww. I'm scared of ending up alone. Oh, Ellie. What about you? It's so touching. Cute scorpion exposure therapy? No. What if the people are still inside? <gasps> what if they're trapped in there without any control of their body? Oh my god, that's, that's a horrible thought indeed. I'm scared that happened to me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. First of all, we're a team now. Okay, we're gonna help each other out. And second, they might still look like people, but that person is not in there anymore. Henry says that they've moved on, that they're with their families, like in heaven. Do you think that's true? I go back and forth. I mean, I'd like to believe it. 
Oh, dude, I feel so strongly. Oh, poor Sammy. Poor all of them, but like Sammy is so gentle. Yeah. You know what I mean? Me neither. Oh. On the serious talk. I almost forgot. No. No. If he doesn't know about it, he can't take it away. All right. I'm pooped. I'll see you tomorrow. <gasps> no, 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 I can refuse. We're gonna find a cure. No, Ellie's gonna find a cure. No, everything's gonna be fine. They have two days. No, 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 he got his toy. He got his toy. No, no, no. I had a feeling he got bit, dude. I don't know why. No, no, no. Just no, no, no. No, 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 no. Shit, he's turning. That's my fucking brother! <laughs> Screw it! Shit! Really? Gotta be real right. They can't do this. Oh Sam? Oh no. Sam? Henry? Gotta <gasps> stay there. Henry? What have you done? <gasps> I'm gonna get that gun from me, okay? Oh, okay, okay, easy. Is it your fault? This is nobody's fault, Henry. It's all your fault! Henry! Henry, no! Jackson City, right? No, sure, dude. You ready to see dear old brother? I'm just ready to get there. Nervous? No, all the. It happens so fast. Like that was overnight. Well, I guess he's a kid. I guess it advances differently in kids versus adults. And then. Oh my God. I live in Spain without the S now? Yeah. Oh. That was devastating. I was not expecting that. I was not, like... And I think that's why, too, because this game... You think you know a certain way this is gonna go. Like, I thought we would maybe split up you know, things were getting too happy. Things were getting too happy, but just... And he got the toy. He got the toy, but he just didn't care anymore. Because he, he already knew it was going to happen. And he just wanted to live a little bit longer as a human. This is beautiful. This is beautiful, but it's it's sad. It's really sad. It's fucking sad as as hell. I really like these flowers. I forget what they're called, but they're very pretty. Dragon something? Aren't these dragon somethings? Oh, I got a new gun! Yay! Oh, thanks. A weapon. I mean, that's cool and stuff. Press X to zoom. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah. So much for this road. Yay. Just follow the river. It'll lead us straight to Tommy's. Come on. The moment he killed his brother, I knew what was going to happen at that point, but I was not expecting any of that. 
And they played the trope really well of the, the, the one who gets bitten and doesn't tell anybody. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Looks like Bright Lavender. No, Lavender wouldn't have those tips. It, it, I see what you're saying, but it, um, they're called dragon somethings, I think. I, snap dragons! I think they're called snap dragons. There we go. Oh. Hang on, where, where are we going? I'm like, I'm just lost. Emotionally lost. <laughs> You know, there's always a trope of that person who hides the bite and, you know, they infect others and stuff. What do you mean? You and Tommy. You're not together, so clearly something went down. We just had a bit of a disagreement, that's all. Ah, oh, here we go. So what was it about? <laughs> Tommy saw the world one way, I saw it the other. And that's why he joined the fight. Hey, Aid, welcome in. How you doing? Yeah, your friend Marlene. I like the name of those better anyways. He busy for a while, but just like Tommy, he eventually quit that too. How was it? The last time you saw him. I believe his last words to me were, I don't ever want to see your goddamn face again. Not sure what they went through? That's devastating. So he's gonna help us? I suppose we're gonna find out. Oh. Yeah, I guess we are. Is without his help? Okay. Dragon lilies? What's a dragon lily? Oh, dude, it's so sad. You ever wonder if you... Do you wonder if you got that double kill now? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so sad. You missed something? Oh. Is it important? See, I'm not gonna lie. I have, like, no memory of where I'm going. I, I don't even know... Dude, I'm still reeling. I'm reeling. You walk by something while reading chat? Hang on, give me one minute. <laughs> What is even happening? How could they do this? How could they do this? How are you doing? I'm great, 8, but we just encountered a very dev emotionally devastating segment of this game. And to be honest, I'm just like really sad about it. No, I can't. No, I just. Chat, we need to talk about this. This is so sad. So, dude, it's just. I like what they do though. They they do this. Okay, so they cut it off immediately and then they move to a new area. And they do and they put you in this beautiful area and it's it's it says fall. So obviously we've been traveling for a while on foot, so it time has passed. And so we don't even get to watch the characters have their moment to just be sad. Do you know what I mean? We don't get to have that moment of like, "Oh my god, we just hear it cut off." And then, boom, new area. Oh, what happened with Tommy? Oh, we're in a new area. Do you know what I mean? And that sort of, oh, dude, it makes you just real. Like, you're in this area. That, there's a reason that the start of this section starts off calm and just, like, beautiful. is because they want you to do what they had to do. Compartmentalize and go. Do you know what I mean? Just compartmentalize and go. I missed something while looking at chat, huh? Uh, the problem is, I don't remember where I went. Oh, it's just this. Wait, what the hell is this picture? Oh my god. The victory of the travelers was absolute, and so too were the terms of humanity's surrender. The living flesh of every man, woman, and child left alive was claimed as the spoils of war. For how long can Daniela escape their terrible grasp? Oh. Naughty Dog is a beautiful approach. To emotional climax of characters very similar to how Game of Thrones and even the tempo is still building there's always a reason for it yeah no I get it I mean I wouldn't compare it to Game of Thrones but that's because I don't like Game of Thrones <laughs> and I think this is so beautifully done um uh but no I know what you're saying absolutely they they made us love those characters and they took them away and I don't know I should have seen it coming but I just didn't see it happening like that and then you know, it just skips to the next day, and then you're like, okay, what do we know? It's it's a day or two before you succumb to infection. Maybe we have time. Maybe we have time, right? We didn't have time. Do you know what I mean? It's just devastating. They have a bunch of these near Niagara for, like, the water, the hydroelectric dam. There, There's, like, this really cool thing. Said it's okay, we'll find the cure. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Like that, I said, okay, maybe we can find the cure. Maybe that's what's gonna happen. And then it's like, nope, 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 nope. 
I was so naive then. Dude, it is so well done. But here's the thing, we we do have hope. Like, we, we do, because we have Ellie, but like, it, it's not the type of hope that it's gonna come soon. When you're finished, I highly recommend moving the second one right away. Maybe. That's true, that's true. I'll, I'll probably play it pretty soon, because that's a good point. Oh, we gotta get to the other side, so how do we get to the other side? Maybe we, we can swim? I don't think that's a good idea in a hydroelectric dam, but maybe we do have to swim. Okay, I guess we be swimming. I found something. So hang tight. Ah, here we go. This looks promising. Oh, oh, one moment, please. <sighs> Can't believe it. It just hit different. How many times has this happened in a game? Do you know how many times has this exact thing happened in a game? It's like the biggest trope, you know? But they just do it in such a way that you really get this emotional connection with them. And then when you're when you're alone with Sam, and it, it's really similar to what happened with um, the the people that you that you read about, you know? You read about them and you know you know what happened to them you know they ended up it ended up going bad for them they ended up dying all of them they ended up turning and you know i don't know you just you just kind of experience that and now like similarly we did all that we got to know these people emotionally just for them to end up like that 